What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be discussing the Arika Bodyboard Cultura 2019. So the Eureka event was another huge success on the South American tour. It was unbelievable to see the quality of waves and the level of riding this year was something that was way past what I expected. I'm so stoked to be able to be a part of this event again this year as it was a huge success with some pumping waves for some of the days and then even that final day we saw some amazing rides go down. The event structure this year was unbelievable. The guys really put a lot of work and a lot of effort into it and the Flopos team can really pat themselves on the back on an amazing event and just to have put all of that together into such a successful event this year is an awesome thing to see once again. It was again Pierre-Louis Costas that went and took out the win at the Eureka event this year. He put on an amazing display and just beat Tanner McDaniel who was last year defending champ. Tanner threw down a massive air reverse in the finals but it just wasn't enough to get past Pierre and get to that first position. So the waves this year were absolutely amazing. We had two or three days of perfect conditions. It was amazing to see guys push the level of bodyboarding. Even watching Omarie Laverne put a perfect 20 heat together and it was just something amazing to see all the bodyboarders were at the top shouting and screaming. I'd just like to say a huge shout out to everyone that supported me throughout this year and throughout the South American leg. It was a really tough leg for me mentally and physically. I'm just not in the form that I wanted to be. My health is really taking a huge toll under the amount of stress that I'm putting myself under and that is causing my health to kind of deteriorate slowly. But in saying that, I am lucky that I've got such an amazing team behind me and I'm actually off to go see a sports psychologist while I'm at home. And I'm just hoping that this will get me in a better mental space and a better headspace in order to compete throughout the rest of this 2019 year and just be on a good note heading into 2020 and my competitive year ahead. When it comes to the event, a huge thank you to Union Flopos and all the people that were involved in making this event such a success. Eureka is always one of those places that we get there and we are just treated like royalty. The fans love us and we're just so stoked to be back at a place that enjoys having bodyboarding there and really puts bodyboarding on the map. This year was nothing less than a success and I'm just so stoked to be part of that bodyboarding community, pushing the level of bodyboarding and really trying to get it to that next level where it should be. Thanks everyone for watching. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and comment something down below that you'd like to see in the next couple videos. I really appreciate all your guys' support. If you like the channel, subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can get notified first for new videos. We'll see you guys in the next video.